Hey there folks, in today's video I'm going to show you how to repair scratches on your white appliances. Here on my upright freezer we have two very large scratches here on the front door near the bottom and actually a small one here as well. So what we're going to be doing, first I'm going to clean it with some Windex to make sure there's no dirt. Just going to wipe it clean, make sure it's nice and dry before you apply any of the paint. So once it's nice and dry, we're going to be using this product right here. It's called Mr. Touch-Up. It's an appliance touch-up paint. And it has this little brush in the lid. And we're just going to apply it to the scratched area. We're going to be applying it thicker than a normal paint because we'll be sanding it down. Now you want this touch-up paint because as you can see, it's thicker than a normal paint. So it's actually filling in these very deep scratches as I go. A normal paint would just sag into the scratches as it dries. All right, so that's all the scratches that there are. So we're gonna leave this overnight and we'll come back tomorrow and we're just gonna sand it with some light sandpaper. So we'll see you in the morning. Good morning, folks. So our paint has been drying overnight. Now it's all nice and dry. We're gonna wet sand it. I have a little piece of wet sandpaper. This is 2000 grit and a little water bottle. We're just gonna spray our surface get it wet same with sandpaper and just use your finger so you don't scuff anything that you don't need to And just be nice and patient.
Okay, now that's done, just spray it and we're gonna wipe it off. Now it's not gonna look perfect, but it's a lot closer than what we had it. So all you're trying to achieve is a nice smooth finish that's smooth to the touch. And then after you're done, if you want to take some car wax, you can even do that to shine it up. And I'm actually going to take this product here. It's a car wash and wax. I'm just gonna wet my towel over in my sink. Put a little turtle wax on it. And we're just gonna buff it up. Cause you will notice if you look at it at the right angle that where you sanded there will be flat spots so it won't be shiny anymore. And that's why you just use your finger, don't use a large Sanding surface. Now this doesn't look perfect, it is gonna stick out, but at least it's an off white, it's not perfectly matched. But we're pretty close. And better than big scratches. And there you have it, that's all there is to it. So we're gonna zoom out. So that's what we're looking at now. Not too bad, you can still see it, but it looks a lot better. Hopefully this was helpful and please like and subscribe.